if you know, in a falling object, had gen you know, due to gravity, creates momentum. And in this case, what we're looking at, or what I'm trying to demonstrate, is that the falling process, the falling of the hands, the falling of the arms, creates momentum, which then can be converted into throwing. This process of handbrake. And key elements here are that the hands are along for the ride, which I've said. Separation, and, and also not only is the, is the creating of momentum, initial momentum, important, which I'm demonstrating here, hopefully, or trying to illustrate here, I should say. But also that handbrake, I mean that scapula loading, which I, again is a, is a key element, and we'll talk more about this later, is a hugely important element of the throwing process. And that scapula loading begins with handbrake. That, they, that, that we're not breaking the hands. What we're doing is we're using the elbows. You can see the elbows are lifting. The elbows are lifting. Now, one of the key points is that once the hands separate, the elbows don't drop any further than what you see here. Uh, that they, What happens is that the actual separation process is due to the fact that the elbows are being elevated or being lifted. Again, a very important point in terms of uh, the throwing process. Uh, and so again, the key points here is that the symmetry, see how the symmetry of, of, hand, of the action, symmetry meaning that if you draw a straight, if you looked at, and let's see if I can give a different view here, um, if you looked at the, the way that the, and I'll turn this around a little bit, if you look at how the hands, they fall, they go right down the middle of the body, they try, so they just drop, Gravity takes over and they and they separate. And separation is caused by lifting the elbows. It's caused by a scapular action. So again, key points here are allowing gravity to work for you. Let the hands drop. You can, you know, a lot of players will start their hands a little higher, and letting that momentum, without any pauses, and that's a key element, without any pauses or hesitation, just smooth one complete. I mean, one smooth uh, process. And then the transition goes from the hands dropping to the elbows lifting, separating, and then into the throw itself. 